Hi, my name is Bob Sira, Regional Sales Manager for Highland Ridge RV. Today I'm at Zoomers RV in Wabash, Indiana, and I'm going to do a walk around on this open range 427 BHS. Uh, this is a very popular floor plan for us. Uh, total exterior length is going to be 41 feet and total dry weight is going to be about 12,750 pounds. So I guess we'll start from the front and then we'll go to the rear. So if you want to follow me, we'll start in the front. So starting off with our front cap, this is going to be a molded fiberglass front cap with automotive paint. So this is going to last you a very long time. Also has a very nice curve to it. So it's going to give you a great turning radius. And then you're going to have your LED docking lights. Makes it easier to hook up the truck earlier in the morning or late at night. Underneath that, very large basement storage. So plenty of room for all your gear. Moving on to the propane. We're gonna give you 60 pounds of propane on this coach. Um, and that's gonna be three 20 pound LP bottles. So a few advantages to the 20 pound bottles to the 30 pound is it's gonna be very convenient to refill them. And then also with the 20 pound bottles being a little bit shorter than the 30 pound bottles, that allows us to give you a few more inches of additional headroom in the upper deck area. Moving along to the passenger storage. This, is, this does have a drop frame, so that allows for maximum passenger storage space. Also finished off very nicely with no exposed wood. On the other side is gonna be your battery disconnect. And then you have your controls for your six point fully electric one touch auto level system. So with that system with just one touch of a button, this trailer will level itself. And then another great feature of that is it remembers the height of when you unhooked from your truck. So making, so hooking back up to your truck is, uh, is more convenient. Um, looking at the side of the trailer here, we're gonna have frameless windows. Uh, these are automotive frameless windows with 80% tint on the windows. So um, it's gonna give you more privacy during the day. Your neighbors can't look in, but you can see out. Also is gonna keep the coach um, a lot cooler in the hot summertime. 427 is gonna have two exterior awnings for a total of uh, 29 feet of awning space. Also is gonna have the LED porch lights built in, as you can see, as well as exterior speakers on the awnings. Um, Moving along to the entrance door here, we are going to have the solid steps by Lippert. So these steps are going to be very sturdy going in and out of your coach. Um, we also have an additional step for the first step. Uh, getting in and out uh, makes it easier. On the entrance door, we're going to have a very large grab handle. So very wide grip, very easy to open the door. Another great feature on the entrance steps is they ride on the inside of the coach when you're driving down the road so they don't get really dirty. We're gonna have the key alike system. So one key is gonna open up all your doors. Moving along to the rear here, um, this floor plan does have the half bath. This is a very convenient feature. Um, so if you have friends and family over, and uh, you guys are hanging out outside, you don't have to take off your shoes or um, track through the whole unit to use the, to use the restroom. Now going on to the outside kitchen, very large outside kitchen, great setup. Um, gonna have the large refrigerator. Then underneath that, we're gonna have the cutting board slash countertop and then storage underneath there as well along with a trash bag hookup. Steel powder coated countertops along with a steel powder coated drawer for your griddle. We started doing the griddle a few years ago. This has been a, uh, a great feature for us. People have really enjoyed it. This is great for cooking eggs, bacon, steaks, whatever you'd like to cook. Also has a built-in grease pan. And then also um, we have a patented gas valve. So um, what this is, is you turn the valve up and this turns on the propane and then you turn it down and this will turn off the propane. 
so you no longer need to crawl underneath the coach every time you want to use your outside kitchen to hook up the, uh, hook up the LP line. Then we're going to have the uh, sink above and then uh, more storage up above with cargo nets. LED lighting inside as well. So moving on to the rear wall, as you can see, two windows going into the bunk room. So uh, this is going to give you more sunlight into your bunk room. Also a fixed ladder that goes up onto your fully walkable roof. And your slide outs are also, also fully walkable as well. Speaking of the roof, we have a PVC roof, um, roof material. Um, we feel it's the be best roof material in the industry. A um, few um, advantages to that PVC material. Number one, 20 year non prorated warranty. It's going to be maintenance free, no treatments required. Um, there's going to be no chalking on that material. So you're not going to get the black streaks running down the side of the coach. And then also, um, it's very reflective material. So it's going to keep your coach uh, warmer in the wintertime and cooler in the hot summertime. A um, few other things on the rear wall fully laminated. So it's not free hung along with our slide out end walls. Those are going to be fully laminated and that's going to be two inch thick and that's going to be a, a vacuum bonded wall. Um, accessory hitch, two inch accessory hitch rated for 300 pounds. This is great for cargo uh, racks, bike racks, things like that. LED tail lights and then our corner moldings. So for all of our corner molds, um, this is going to be a triple sealed corner. So what I mean by triple sealed corner is um, we're going to have 3M flashing tape, then we're going to have geo cell caulk, then we're going to have the metal bracket up above. So three sealants for all of your corners to make sure that no water ever gets inside your sidewall. Um, the last thing I'd just like to mention um, before we head inside is our cold weather package. So this uh, unit is rated for zero degrees and um, we feel we have uh, the best, if not, or one of the best, if not the best cold weather package on the market. So we're gonna have R38 insulation in the floor, R38 insulation in the roof, R38 in the front cap, and then R9 in the sidewall. Now, that is a lot of insulation, but the real reason why, feel, why we feel we have the best cold weather package on the market is the way that we insulate the underbelly. So we have, um, we have four inch heat duct hoses that are connected to the furnace and those um, is, th that creates forced air into the suspended holding tanks. The, the hot air then heats, uh, hits a heat barrier. Heat then travels on top of the suspended holding tanks and the pipes. And then here's the kicker, return air vent comes up through the coach. So we have circulating air throughout the entire underbelly and the coach at all times that's heating up your holding tanks and your pipes. Um, so we can head inside now. So the first thing I'd like to mention on the inside is this is a brand new decor for us for 2021. In the summertime, we came out with our 2021 models and uh, did a complete interior refresh. Pretty much everything was touched from the furniture fabric to the flooring, to the countertops, to the wallboard, um, to the cabinets. So. Um, I think the design team did a really good job and we've just gotten rave reviews from the new look. This is called Boardwalk Decor and um, really gives it a nice uh, modern farmhouse look. I um, guess we'll get started in the, in the kitchen. So this does have the kitchen island. Um, we're going to have solid surface countertops throughout. Uh, this is going to be very similar to Corian. So um, this is going to be uh, very durable. It's going to be scratch resistant. You can put hot plates on it. It's not going to ruin that material. We're going to have the nice high-rise faucet, pull out with dual action. Then we're going to have the cutting board, the strainer on top, and then the uh, uh, stainless steel undermount sink uh, that is a single basin. So it's not going to have the divider in the middle, so plenty of room to put your hot uh, or to wash your uh, large pots and pans. Underneath this, large bank of drawers with the pull out waste basket. On the other side, we're going to have the kitchen slide. This is going to be a shallow slide, so it's not going to eat up a lot of space into your campsite, but still plenty of room for all your appliances. Um, speaking of the appliances, largest oven in the industry. 
This is going to be a full 3.73 cubic foot. Up above, four burner stovetop. Up above that, um, residential size convection microwave. Then we're going to have the pull out spice rack. This really makes use of great, great space. Um, we pull it out towards you, so it makes great use of otherwise dead space back there. So you can put spices or whatever else you'd like to do. 21 cubic residential refrigerator with the ice maker. So very, very large refrigerator, as you can see. Plenty of room. Something unique that we do as well is we have a baggage door cut out on the outside where you can um, access your, your uh, ice maker water lines. So um, when you do have to winterize your ice maker in the fall time, um, you can access it there. This is a big feature. Um, some people don't have it. And if you don't have that feature, you have to pull the entire fridge out to access those water lines. And uh, you know you can damage your linoleum. Sometimes you can't even get the fridge out because the island's in the way. So that's another great feature on our residential refrigerators. Um, we'll talk about the other side now. So this is going to be a full seven foot uh, tall slide, 42 inches deep. Um, this 427 um, has the, the big U lounge optioned in. This is a very popular feature. Almost 100% of all of our 427s is going to get the U lounge. Really opens up the whole coach and it gives you enough room for the whole family to lounge around. It does come with two tables. As you can see, one table set up, eat dinner on it, play cards, whatever you'd like to do. When you're not using the table, you can store them in the uh, storage uh, underneath the two compartments on either end of the U-Lounge. And then we have a bed in the center of the U-Lounge as well. So this is going to be a queen size bed. This is going to fold out like a trifold, so you don't need to inflate or deflate uh, an air mattress. Up above that, plenty of windows. Then we're going to have the premium MCD blinds, day and night shade. So really nice feature there. And then we're going to have large overhead cabinets. Uh, speaking of the slide outs, uh, something that Open Range is kind of known for is no carpeting in our slides. So we were the first ones to do this about five or six years ago. And it's something that's really been a big hit for us. So not only does this look good, but it's going to, uh, it's going to make keeping your floors um, a lot easier to keep clean. Uh, speaking of the floor, something else you'll notice, no vent cutouts in our floor. So a few advantages to having no vent cutouts. Number one, it's going to keep the structural integrity of the floor a lot stronger. Um, and then also, um, with all the vents being in the kitchen island, maybe a wall or furniture, um, it helps keep dust and dog hair out of those vents. So um, that's an important feature because, as we know, when debris gets inside those vents, it's really tough to, to clean out. So maybe we'll talk about the entertainment center. So large 50 inch TV for the entertainment center. Countertop below, you could put a DVD or uh, a Bluetooth DVD or a PlayStation on this countertop here. Uh, stereo system, so this is gonna be radio, um, AM, FM, Bluetooth. So if you'd like to stream from your phone, you can do that two large speakers beside that. Then we're gonna have the fire, electric fireplace. This does heat up to 82 degrees, so this is a uh, great space heater on those cool fall nights or cool uh, spring nights when you don't wanna use your propane from your furnace, you can turn this on. So now we'll head into the bunk room. The bunk room is uh, one of the, the best features on this floor plan um, because we're gonna give you quad bunks with the full outside kitchen. You typically only get uh, three bunks with a full outside kitchen. So that's a, a big advantage here. So you can have your top bunk, then you're gonna have your jackknife sofa. This does fold down into a bed, and then we're gonna have storage underneath here. Each bunk is gonna have their own window. So window below, the window above. And then we're gonna finish off the window coverings with um, a nice covering that doesn't have any strings, so your kids aren't gonna get their, their, their hands stuck in them. Um, large uh, closet here, 
plenty of hanging space, storage up above, large drawers underneath. On the other side, an additional large overhead cabinet, perfect for games or toys or whatever you'd like to put in there. Then we're going to have the uh, hookup for a, for a TV. So if you'd like to put a bunk room TV in here, you can do that. And then we're going to have the breakdown table right here. All you do is flip this up, and then it comes with a leg, and uh, eat dinner off of it, play games, use it as a workspace, uh, whatever you'd like to do. On the other side, bunk up top, and then we're going to have a fold-down bunk below for a total of four bunks in here. Um, if you would like more floor space, you can keep it up. Um, and then storage underneath there as well. On this side, porcelain toilet, sink, mirror, and then storage underneath the vanity. So we're in the hallway now. Um, as you can see, large coat closet. So plenty of room for coats, sweaters, whatever you'd like to do. Maybe shoes underneath. Then we're gonna have your convenience panel. So gonna be all your main light switches, slide outs, awnings, tank readers and you'll see when I open this door, the light automatically comes on. We also have the Ridgelink standard on this unit. So what this is, is you can download an app on the Google uh, Play Store or the Apple Store, and uh, you, can, you can control your slide outs, your lights, your leveling system, and uh, we call this the Ridgelink. So really, really a nice feature. Uh, going up into the bathroom here, So starting off, under mount sink, um, medicine cabinet, storage behind here, storage underneath the vanity, porcelain toilet. Then we're going to have the 48 by 30 one piece uh, seated residential shower. We are going to have the three glass panes, so it um, gives you a wider room for entry. And then we're going to have the skylight, lets in nice natural light, and then also gives you some additional headroom. On this side, large medicine cabinet storage, uh, storage behind, countertop space, pull-out countertop as well, so countertop extension, great for in the morning time when you're getting ready to have that additional countertop space, and then full bank of drawers. Obviously 110 outlets around as well. The other great thing to mention on this, um, the bathroom setup, is it's dual entry. Um, so if you have friends and family over and they're in the living room, you have to use the restroom, you don't have to go out into the hallway to get back into your bedroom. You've got direct, direct ask, access through the second entry. So we'll go into the bedroom now. Um, residential queen bed. A nice, uh, a nice headboard above that. Then we're going to have two windows on either side of the bed with the nice MCD blinds. So it's going to give you great cross ventilation. Then we're going to have shelving on both sides of the bed where you can put your devices. And then storage underneath the bed as well. Um, we are going to have whisper quiet AC um, throughout this unit. So two AC standard. And um, as you can see, we have the returns here for the, for the whisper quiet AC. This is a great feature. I'm sure we've all been in campers in the hot summertime where the AC is running all day and it's just really even tough to talk or watch a movie because that, that AC, those AC units are so loud. So you can, um, just, uh, you can barely hear the AC and you still get um, really nice airflow out of those AC units. So it's something I always like to talk about is our whisper quiet AC. Behind me here is gonna be the wardrobe closet. So plenty of hanging space storage up above, two large drawers underneath, and then we're going to have the secondary closet over here as well. So this is going to give you more storage space, and then we are prepped for a stackable washer and dryer. So if you'd like to put a stackable washer and dryer in here, you can do that. Up top, hook up for a television, so you can put a uh, bedroom TV in here if you'd like. Nice campsite window. And then we're going to have the dresser with large oversized, two large oversized drawers. Um, that about wraps up the walkthrough. Um, this is the 2021 uh, Zoomers Virtual Open House. Um, 
We would love to see you here and um, come out and see us. So thank you.